Today, we're talking about Twin, the trade worldwide information network, an IOTA-driven game changer set to transform how goods and data move across borders. Stop. No. Twin is an open source digital infrastructure, and its goal, ladies and gentlemen, is to revolutionize global trade. Built on IOTA, Twin connects entities in the business of doing international trade. We're talking governments, organizations, and even lower level businesses who ship internationally. The point of it all is to share trade data securely and in real time directly from its source. And in doing so, Twin focuses on enabling trust, transparency, and efficiency, pretty much just trying to smash all the inefficiencies of what is a 25 trillion dollar international trade market and to get there twin incorporates digital product passports or dpps as we know them using them to track assets in their life cycles for example batteries are a big up and comer in this regard lots of cars are going electric so corporates can in the future use dpps on a platform like twin to track how batteries are depleting over the years and with some machine learning they'll be able to predict demand and since Twin tracks internationally, you may have a producer in South Korea, for example, shipping to Australia, and they'll still be able to see where their products are at in their life cycle. Twin also uses Decentralized Identity, or DID, to give Twin stakeholders complete control over their shared data without having to worry about a centralized authority who would have the power to halt operations at the drop of a hat. So let's say you're in the business of producing coca leaves, you won't have to worry about some pesky government stopping your trade. Twin also has projects like the Virtual Watchtower, designed to streamline maritime logistics. With maritime trade, according to Grok, accounting for about 80% of transported products. And with the backing of the World Economic Forum and the Tony Blair Institute, the look ahead for Twin is optimistic. The Virtual Watchtower, or VWT, is a flagship project in the Twin ecosystem. It's modernizing maritime logistics by connecting ports and supply chains for real-time data sharing. The VWT pilot program launched at Singapore Maritime Week 2024, and the goal is to test VWT's minimum viable product. And the pilot is currently active and tracking trade activity across Singapore's key trade maritime corridors and it includes a couple of Swedish ports representing the Nordic region. Corporate participants include industry giants like PSA International, Kalmar, Scania, and Stora Enso, alongside research partners that include Sweden's RISE and Singapore's A-Star. With vested interest from the Swedish government and the Singapore Maritime Institute providing funding for the initiative. VWT is aiming to cut port delays by up to 20%, potentially saving billions in a market where current inefficiencies cost around $1.8 trillion annually. How VWT and Twin tie together is made a little clearer by a LinkedIn article published by Wolfgang Lemacher. He indicates that the virtual watchtower is powered by Twin by describing the data management solution of VWT as being built on Twin's digital architecture mentioning IOTA specifically when describing that the twin DLT framework enables secure and verifiable data exchanges within VWT net. So while architectural details are scarce, we can infer that IOTA plays a critical role in VWT's data transmission across systems. Now, in terms of ecosystem players, in early 2024 at the World Trade Organization's 13th Ministerial Conference, the IOTA Foundation and Trademark Africa partnered with the World Economic Forum, the Tony Blair Institute, the Global Alliance of Trade Facilitation, and the Chartered Institute of Export and International Trade to advance Twin's neutral governance and open technology framework. So it seems like a pretty strong cohort, and it seems like there's plenty of opportunity to be had. In the UK, Twin, alongside TLIP, is bringing new life to post-Brexit digital trade vehicles. 
where they are already looking to integrate English port systems and involve the London Port Health Authority for governmental cohesion. If this gets done, it's essentially going to cover 50% of UK trade. With IOTA as the settlement layer, Twin and TLIP are gearing up to enable real-time data sharing for EU to UK customs. We're talking about 450 billion pounds worth of goods annually. And to get there, a group called Mobius Technology has initiated and is currently running a pilot for poultry shipments from Poland to the UK, where the twin slash TLIP systems are tested to see if they can ensure compliance before the products arrive at the border. And this would look something like transportation vehicles arriving at a point of entry, simply showing some kind of verification code. It might be a QR code that can be verified online and they're just sent straight through. And when you're dealing with perishables like animal meat, there is certainly no time for delay. So if you can prove a system that makes it super fast for your goods to get through, you're essentially just gonna print money. The UK could become a favored trade hub or because they make it easier for their trade partners to make money. However, global adoption is key. The Twin Foundation launched in May 2025 in Lusaka, Zambia, and it's a key driver to Twin's vision, with Sir Tony Blair's Institute for Global Change at its heart. Blair calls Twin, not just a piece of technology, it's a transformation. A foundation that will allow countries to modernize their trade systems, connect across borders, and realize the true promise of global trade. It's about building a digital public infrastructure that every government, every business, large or small, can access and can trust. His institute works with the World Economic Forum and Trademark Africa with the intention of pushing Twin's global reach. Now, Blair's political clout could accelerate policy support in regions like the UK and also in Africa, with his advocacy potentially positioning Twin as a cornerstone of digital trade in those regions. And just maybe, there's a little more going on behind the scenes. Time will tell. Twin and IOTA are the perfect match, creating a dynamic trade ecosystem that is built on trust and innovation, where Twin digitizes trade processes by ensuring scalability and traceability across global networks, IOTA provides the DLT backbone that enables secure and transparent data exchange. Twin has an open modular infrastructure that uses open APIs and global standards, and it integrates IOTA for seamless compliant data sharing without requiring that stakeholders in the system have, let's say for example, an Azure or AWS account for the data transmission activities. Now, this is truly one of the unsung values of DLT. You don't have to lock in with a vendor for data-related process. Twin's front-end activity is powered by IOTA's functionality. We're talking smart contract support and decentralized identity. So everything Twin uses to replace manual paperwork and archaic processes, pretty much everything that Twin offers to streamline customs compliance and transparency, well, all of that is settled on IOTA's layer one with smart contracts. And together, the final result is a solution that can save billions annually. Ultimately, Twin has the potential to become the biggest real world use case in crypto. And like we always imagined, the DLT that plays the role of the hero will do it from the shadows.